Hey guys, so today's video I'm just going to try to do a little more dramatic fall type look. I'm sorry that my outfit is really boring and have like this, I don't know, just boring. I was wearing this like shirt that I thought was going to look really cool for it because it's a pretty dramatic look. Maybe I'll put it on for the end of the video, but it was like pretty revealing for this whole top area and whatnot. So I am young and I don't want anyone... <laughs> feeling awkward so maybe I'll wear it in the future or I don't know anyway I'm just gonna jump right in it's gonna be I haven't tried the look out yet uh, so I don't know how it's gonna work but it's pretty dramatic I'm gonna be using like purple dark purple dark blue and dark green anyway so I'm just priming my skin with some stay matte primer going on everywhere cuz I'm gonna put on some BB cream and then moisturizing my skin and I'm going to go ahead and fill my eyebrows really quickly. Such a big difference. Just grooming them with some Rimmel mascara. Um, it's kind of dried out, so don't trip. Okay, and now we are going to prime our eyelids with some NYX HD primer. Sorry if everything's getting like repetitive or whatnot. I just don't really have a lot of makeup. Let me say that again. I don't really have a lot of makeup. <laughs> You know, I'm just going to switch up concealers from what I usually use. I'm just using uh, Fit Me's primer. This is in number 30 Cafe. And I'm just going to get my underbrow or right about here. I'm using fingers for this process once again because... My brushes are disgusting. Well, maybe. So I'm taking Wet n Wild's color icon in Comfort Zone and taking in this color. One of my favorite colors ever. Or eyeshadow colors, I should say. So I'm going to first start by applying uh, this brown, this matte brown color into my into my crease using a fluffy brush or a blending brush I should say and we're just applying this into the crease And that's not exactly perfect right now, but we can fix that. I don't want to run out of light. Okay, so I'm going to now add a matte black in the like very like outer corner type crease part. Just a little bit. Where is it? This this green color right here. I have no idea how this is gonna work out, guys. So bear with me. Anyway, so I'm just applying it with a finger. Oh wait, which? picking up with my finger, and this is going into the first third of my eyelid. Eyelid. Right about here. Know how this is gonna turn out hopefully I like it and now we're gonna take this dark blue and apply it to the middle part of our eyelid because I want a little bit more shimmer to this color I'm gonna add a turquoise color on top of this a little bit later 
uh, once I get the purple on. And then we're going to add this purple color right here onto the outer third. Blending them together. And then I'm going to touch up that blue and blend it with the purple. And same with the green. Okay, and then I'm gonna like lightly blend these together. Like so. I'm just taking like the tip, like the actual like flat part of my brush and like going over it like that. And then with actual brush now, I'm gonna take this turquoise kind of color. And then I'm gonna like dab it onto the blue just to give it like a more shimmery type look but keep the blue and I'm gonna take uh, where is it? this color to highlight in my inner corner ah! I have so much fallout okay for my for my under eyes or whatever, I'm just going to add this dark brown and run it all the way through and kind of connect it right there. So I'm just going to throw on some mascara and be right back. And now finishing touch. Where can I find it? Where you at? There it is. <laughs> Alright, so this is a lipstick by Shani Cosmetics. This is in number four, and it's like this almost coral, almost pink type nude color. So, this is what I'm going to apply. It looks retarded because I like jammed it into my desk yesterday. I love this camera because really I'm kind of almost in the dark doing my makeup and it's really bright on camera. So cool. So this is the completed um, look. I just want to say thank you all for watching. I hope you enjoy this look. I know it's not too much of a wearable look but I'm wearing it, <laughs> so I hope you guys enjoyed my tutorial. I know I skipped a lot, but that's okay. And um, feel free to spread the word, share it on Instagram, Twitter, Facebook, wherever, I don't care. Please subscribe to my channel, like this video, comment video requests, and um, thank you all once again for watching. I really do appreciate it, um, and bye! <laughs>